discovers the secret behind the artist's work. Yeah. Yeah. Um, again, excellent stop was, motion animation. It was beautiful. It, it was beautifully done. It, yes. It couldn't. I don't think it could have been any better. I am. You maybe think if it would follow the story, but uh, yeah. And the story was tweaked a little. I can't. Yeah, I, not, you know not a big deal. And we're, I'm, we're, no. we're laughing about it and making fun of it, but just that part of it, just you being worried about the thing. This yeah. was well done. It was, um, again, only 11 minutes, but it's yeah. so well put together that I'm sure this is I, why they chose to, or what they chose to end the festival or the, at least the shorts block with because right. it was probably production wise and everything else. One of the slickest. Yeah. Ones yeah. They- I would like to know more about the, how they did it. Um, the characters, the figures looked like they were carved out of wood. Mm-hmm. Um, they were like puppet, like they had jointed fingers, you yeah. know, their mouths moved and everything. Um, they were cool. And then the set, the miniature sets were super cool. And there was that needled car. Yeah. And they get in the car and it's zooming through the city, all the city lights and the streets and houses and, um, everything was just so, so well done. Amazing stuff. I wish I could yeah. say that I would have links to all of these movies actually, but oh. I'll look and see what we can find. I wasn't able to find any for that first block really. So yeah. I'm not holding out a lot of faith for this block. But uh, all in all, I enjoyed the day. I wish things would have been a little bit better for you on the physical end, <laughs> which sounds weird uh, or whatever, but you'll have to hear Thanks that. for reminding me I was sick. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> and um, aside from that, I got to say I am looking forward to us going to see uh, this again later in the year, our actual vacation coming up this October here. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Yeah. We'll have to do a total. uh, Well, that will be an on the road episode, won't it? That most certainly will. But I'm thinking in the future when because we do this annually. I mean, it'd be great if we could do it twice a year, but I know we're not going to get to Oregon every year. But once a year we do this and um, maybe maybe some listeners can give us feedback. Like, is it lame for us to go through and mention every single film when we don't actually have them to share with everyone? Um, I don't know how interesting it is hearing about these. Oh my gosh, it was so awesome and great. Everybody should see it. Sorry. It's not anywhere where you can, but well, you know, like, I hope this isn't lame for everybody to what, listen to. What I'm hoping to is maybe they'll put together some more HP Lovecraft, uh, sets, and release those. I mean, somebody stole the ones off of Netflix, unfortunately. Oh, my gosh. But, uh, you know, these are things to look out for. I still have a couple of movies that I've heard about in podcasts that it's yeah. been five or six years, but I still have those movies that I'm looking for because I first heard about it someplace else, and I'm actively seeking those out or passively yeah. seeking those out. with Maybe a better statement, maybe. Not actively. Maybe not actively, maybe passively, but I've got my eye open for those because I remember hearing positive reviews about them from other people. Yeah. So hopefully that's we're doing the same thing here. And, uh, you know, who knows? Maybe like last year, uh, folks contacted us about Clock. We were able to go back and revisit that as a headshot and put yeah. that movie out there. If anybody hears these and um, liked what we had to say about it, we'll still talk to us afterwards. Um, we'll be glad to promote your movie if you've got uh, one of these uh, shorts or one of these movies that you'd like us to talk about. You know what? I was just flipping through my notes, and the very first film was Derleth's Brain. Uh huh. I actually wrote on here that Lovecraft would hate it. I, I remember you saying that. I don't think that we, I didn't say that in the podcast, though. Now I have. Whoops. Now you have. Oh. Oh. Well. Well, Lovecraft's not here to judge. No, I'm here to judge for him. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> well, at any rate, uh, it's been real. So let's uh, say at this point, um, as always, you can get in contact with us by emailing me directly at madsaxon, M-A-D-S-A-X-X-O-N, at yahoo.com. Look us up on Facebook. Put in V-I-C-I-S-I-N-T-E-R-I-M-O, Vices and Teramo, um, or just friend me, S. Michael Jones. That works. Anything to add? I don't think so. I think we killed it. I think so. <sighs> Everything really wrapped up nicely. Hmm. 
Much quicker than usual. I guess we learned that happiness is wherever you find it. And we've all found happiness. Every one of us. 